I'm in the uh, RSL Steeper booth with Ed Grinham, and he has graciously been talked into doing this interview by his cohort here, who said he didn't want to be on camera, so I got to do that. <laughs> All right, so what is it you guys are selling here? Okay, we're talking about switch accessing to iPads, iPod touches, and iPhones. So the device itself is just this device here, it's called Perero. It weighs less than seven grams, and as you can see, it's pretty small. What we do is we simply plug Perero into the into the iDevice. This automatically sets up VoiceOver. There's nothing to download. There's no settings to change, and you can see now we've got a highlighted box over the first cell. So as soon as you plug that in, as soon as you plug this device in, we got VoiceOver turned on, and I yes. heard it out of that speaker. Yeah, we've got some speakers here just so you can hear it a little bit Excellent. more of the show. Yeah. Okay, so there's no settings to go into. There's nothing to download. It automatically loads it up and starts it working straight away. Wow. What we then do is plug in any type of switch. As long as it's got a three and a half mil jack socket on there, it's going to work. Okay. So, so you only do one switch. Yes. So okay. Single switch access. So. We've just got a standard switch here, which is uh, just a standard one I had in stock when we came out. If I press this switch now, it's going to start scanning through the... So we've got step scanning on here now, so every time I press the switch once, it moves one cell. Okay. When I get to the one that I want, I simply press and hold down until it says select. Oh, so you don't have to hit twice and coordinate that kind of action. No, not That's nice. And it opens up the notes, okay? So then I can scan through the notes as much as I want. Oh, let's just come back out of there. So I hold it down until it says home, and then I'm back home. Okay, so I'm just quickly going to show you um, the app that we do for it as well. Okay, so, so did you just turn voiceover off? I did. I've got a triple click home for voiceover yes. off just for ease, and you right. don't have to then dis disconnect the Perero device. The app that we've got is very simple, but all I'm going to do really here is just take this back from step scanning to standard scanning to show that we're going to have a one second scan speed, and we're going to say after three scans, we're going to bring that speed down to 70%. Are you going to tell me what all that meant? Or are you okay, going to demonstrate yeah, absolutely. <laughs> I'll show you right now. So okay. I'll bring this back here. So what we've got now is when I press the switch, it's going to start automatically scanning through every second. Oh. But then it's going to speed up to 70% of that straight away. So I can get through quickly now where I want to go to. But let's say I want App Store and I've just missed it. Okay. The next press I do is going to start to reverse the scan the other way. Oh, nice. Okay, but it's going to go back at the initial speed as well. So I stop it, I press it again, it goes forward. Okay. So I get to the one that I want. Again, I press and hold. Today, and I open up iTunes. Okay. So the point of showing us that was that you're you're showing that you can accelerate the speed and you can uh, and you can have it go forward and backwards with the changes Absolutely. of mode. So if for example you were typing an email, you might want a quick scan speed so when you've got the keyboard up you can fire through the keys, but right. you can stop it there. If you missed it when you want, it goes backwards and you can really hone in on exactly where you want to be. That sounds fantastic. Okay. Now we can go further down now. So if I press and hold a little bit longer, we've now got finger-based gestures. So I've got a swipe right on there. I'm now onto the next page. Did you just go like this? I held it down. And okay. It, so it speaks to me the audible menu, and it says swipe left, swipe right, and I let go on the one that I want it to hear. So when it says swipe right, I release the switch, and it swipes the screen to the right. Oh, so you didn't have to swipe right no, left? No, no, no. Oh, okay. so all I'm doing is a push button switch. Okay. So that's great if you're in iBooks or something like Leo, because you can read a book and you can then the device will read the book to you and all you have to do is then is swipe the page left and right and it'll turn the page and you can carry on going through. Oh very nice. Okay, so a great benefit of this device as well is the fact that it is connected directly in. It doesn't use Bluetooth to connect in, so it's a solid connection, it's on all the time. It's not prohibited from use anywhere, so you can use it in a hospital, you can use it on an aeroplane. Oh, oh, that is nice. Yeah, and uh, I'm sorry, but Bluetooth is just hinky, right? I mean, when it works, it's wonderful, but exactly, so okay. often it's like, oh, I'm fighting with it. So we eradicate that. We don't have to worry about Bluetooth. We don't have to worry about if your connection drops out, because if your connection drops out and you use Bluetooth, how are you going to get back onto it? Right. Okay? So now we get around that because it's in and it's, it's on. It's hardwired. And so the device is called Perero. Perero, which is Latin for to scan. Oh, nice, nice. Okay. I like it. And uh, so how much is per arrow? It's 275 US. 275 US? Yes. Okay. Absolutely. And then uh, you have your own switches. Uh, people have their own switches, I people assume? People have their own switches, okay? So we don't want to make the price more and give you right. a switch because sure. you might not want to use that switch and it ends up in a cupboard. Right. So right, right. use your own switch that you're happy and comfortable with because it will work with it. All right, very cool. Well, thank you very much, Ed. How would people find this now? Um, you can go to rslsteeper.com. 
um, and just have a look through us. We'll be on the websites, or you can search us on Twitter at, at Ferrero. Ferrero, very um, much. Any last thing? No, that's fine. All right, thank, thank you very much, Ed. Thank you very much.